Okay, recording check. I got the second uh, I uh, I know I posted uh, something on uh, Twitter and uh, Instagram, so check that out. So my venomous uh, dark eagle channel should be uh, it should this should be red. And I think I'm official channel. I'll show you guys. Right here, it should be red. So, I uh, started a new uh, playlist uh, called uh, Heat Wave. Uh, it's sort of like a summer themed background. But, you know, same songs. Maybe some diss tracks. And, yeah. You know. Oh. I'll show you guys uh, what it looks like. I made it on uh, Canva.com and also did some edits on Paint 3D. The usual one I uh, used to do uh, edits. I'm eating cherries. We're great around summertime. Or oh, what warm weather. So, anyways, here you go. This is what it looks like. Sun. So, what's missing, like right here, is uh, the the fire emo emo emoticon. But once I converted it over from Canva. dot com to Paint three D, it uh, that wouldn't allow me. So I have to. That uh, is my only option. Or I have to get a fire pick. And I didn't do it because. Uh, so, so it's uh, not so it's going to kind of be pale. So, so just uh, same, off the same uh, LP, LP17, uh, Wild Beats Multimedia, Wild Bandits, Venomous, and Dark Skies World Channel. Mm hmm. So I wanna explain now. Uh, I have uh, never done this kind of stuff, but so everything except the fire was uh, done on Canva. So I'm gonna start off with the corner. There's there's the sun, blazing hot sun. It's the weather is like super hot right now. So it makes sense, you know, if I have that. I'm gonna sorta of veer over to here. And there's a familiar character. Any uh, girls will know this uh, sunset, sunset shimmer. I was think, thinking, hmm, why your characters, huh? There's a, like a fiery arrow. There was the like, yeah, sure, I'll add her. This is from the Equestria, Equestria Girls uh, one, so, yeah. Moving over slightly, there's Volcarona. So, this, it, those, those of you who know, uh, yeah, I am a Pokemon fan, so I'll explain. Uh, this is a Pokemon from uh, Gen 5. So this uh, used to be like the sun Pokemon, uh, and uh, people use the this Pokemon as the sun when uh, like the daytime and such. Burning up. You know, like a and then like a caution thing like right there, right there. <laughs> Good like that. I, I could have uh, added a thermometer, but uh, Canva.com uh, always charges uh, people. You have to like, get a pro, pro account uh, and uh, pay uh, money monthly for if you want to get some certain, like, 
the great best settings don't they give you the basic ones which are like kind of lame but yeah sometimes you you have to go with it or sometimes you can uh save uh photos from google images or bing or whatever server and uh save it to your hard drive and then you can move it to you can like import it to like a uh, canva no charge and uh you don't uh it doesn't take up space and it always uh saves uh and found in your profile, so yeah, which bring also brings us to the second thing water drop. So, people are gonna like need a lot of water for that because it's gonna get hot, hotter, and yeah, uh, those with the uh, pools are very lucky because, because uh, you know beaches are closed and yeah you know and also people don't want to be sweating so i added that <laughs> moving now right, right below there's pansier a fire type pokemon one of the monkeys there's the grass monkey pan sage fire monkey pansier the, the one I'm looking at right now and Pantor the water sort of like the water monkey so yeah so you uh, before you battle your first gym uh, in a uh, gen 5 uh, your uh, you can uh, pick out a Pokemon pick out one of the three monkeys so so if you pick the grass type like you want to go with uh, this one if you want to pick, if you pick the water type, uh, go with the grass one. And if you pick the fire type, you uh, you want to go with the water one. And uh, just as a joke, uh, so I have an arrow pointing there at a bug, which is sort of hanging off the D off dark. So reason, the reason I added that one is uh, because uh, I have seen lots of uh, fly, large flies, small flies, mosquitoes, and uh, other, even centipedes and other bugs around. So I just added that as a, you know, summer weather's coming, and yeah, we're gonna have to see, we're gonna see a lot of these. <laughs> oh, which brings me to another Pokemon. My, one of my favorites, I'm um, working towards uh, getting one in Pokemon Go. <laughs> Chandelure. <laughs> I currently have a Lampent, the uh, pre-evolution of uh, this. And the Ghost and Fire type. Uh, oh yeah, forgot to mention, this is a Bug Fire type. <laughs> That's just a Fire type. <laughs> So oh, yeah, they are like one of the one of my favorites uh, in the game, and I can't hope to get one very soon. Cause I'm gonna be walking out a lot uh, during the summer and evolve it before probably June maybe, or you know by the end of June I hope. And that brings me to. Flame Princess. Uh, one of my favorite characters from uh, Adventure Time, <laughs> a Cartoon uh, Network uh, show created by uh, Pendleton Ward. So literally, so literally anything she touches, touches turn like lights on, lights on fire. And she's weak to water, so e even uh, if there's uh, any water touching uh, any of the fires she's created, uh, yeah, she gets her hurt. <laughs> but she proven she has proven to be like one of the top characters in the in the series, and yeah.
and one of the everlasting characters in the, yeah. The series never died off. And then there's the, the reason why I added fire is because, yeah, there has been some fires going on, and the weather has been, uh, well, they've been uh, super warm lately, and uh, so, yeah. So they get like a freaking fire every day. And, yeah. Oh, yeah, and like places like California, I hope we don't have another wildfire, especially during the, yeah, terrible times. And it brings me to campfire. Yeah, uh, it's fire symbol or campfire. I was going to add one, so it's basically heating up the text, burning it, burning up everything, like right here, <laughs> except for flame princess. So it's just burning up everything. It also goes, sort of goes with that term heat wave, so I figured it would make sense. So. so, the text uh, down below is uh, sort of hard to see because. Uh, Because the paint Canva has a, like a, some uh, whacked out uh, text uh, functions, and uh, well, uh, Paint Three D does not. And uh, Paint Three D, uh, when uh, whenever you like do do a like, background, you have to save it first before you add anything else. So if you add on any of anything first before adding a background, so you're gonna like literally see literally nothing but you know color and you won't see any any of the objects you've added and yeah every time you add an object if it's not like a, at a certain size it'll adjust the, the page and, and that's why sometimes like you like uh, using canva because uh, everything is like literally locked in so like so and nothing uh, moves so if I were to be on a candle, candle right now, so I could like move this, move any anything, add more text, erase text, but I can't do any uh, and I can uh, can't do anything like a uh, pen pen functions. So I have to, so I have to save it first on Canva, download it to it downloads, move it to my hard drive on my computer or laptop in this case and yeah I have to open the paint 3d file and I'd have to open it and I can make edits there but as soon as I make an edit yeah, I can't change anything because I once I use eraser I end up erasing like say you erase something like this there's this, there's going to be like a white eraser mark right there <laughs> so those are sometimes the, the disadvantages of uh, using a uh, Paint 3D. <laughs> oh, that's uh, the idea of uh, making a heat wave. I'll make some abuse of stuff on uh, the heat on, uh, on uh, this uh, play playlist uh, this week and uh, next week. And there will be like more to come. Nice. End the video. Time to light stuff on fire. <laughs>